once again. Thank you for the likes, the comments, the shares, the subscribe. Um, collective, be mindful of your debit card, your credit card, um, your transaction um, on your card. This is for uh, people who want to have money or people who have money. Um, there is these sites, websites that's taking money off your car. Also, be careful where you use your car at, too, because arms go with certain people that work in certain individuals that can take information from your car and use it, and use, it. Uh, uh, use your car without your permission. All they need is your PIN number and the little thing, you push your PIN number in and have the whole car information, okay? So there's this individual that works that's cool with these car beats. Could be gas station, could be stores, could be laundry mat. All right, be careful using your car. All right, at these locations I told you about before because I had a few transactions that I wasn't mine, so, right? I don't know what all of a sudden my brand new car I have to can I have to cancel it. Some from the toys, something, some other shit, some other shit. I listen, be careful where you use your car because comics get cool with these people in the store, they get cool with these people in the gas station, get cool with these people in the room, you know, in these locations that you press to swipe your um, ATM, got your whole information, okay? That's what I'm and that was a brand new car, so I kind of cancel it, and another one is coming in the mail. Um, things that you did order, you need to check your bank statement every now and then, every now and then, and your debit card information every now and then. People with money, you too. On a regular basis, okay. Not let you notify you what is being taken out of your car. Luckily, that went to my phone and I seen it, okay. Um, seen the damn um thing and it go through, all right, because I had to transfer that money onto a whole nother fucking car. But it's the point is that shit had happened on that brand new car. So it's places that you go to, like gas station, ATMs, swiping your car just to buy a few items. Be careful and look out for that because there's some stupid shit going on and these cars are using your information as well. Uh to 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 um so when I call and I had to cancel it and they're gonna order me a new one. Tell me why that motherfucker over there, you know what bang like like he knew like they knew what was up. So like I said, it could be cool with the individual at these stores and locations to get your motherfucking information, use your information to order um, um, thing online, all right, and you might not be aware and got like $40, $60, dollars $60 transaction on your motherfucking card, and it wasn't you, be careful, all right, go back and look at your bank statement, go back on your card and check your balance and go back in your bank, your bank, and, 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 and dispute that, all right, cancel that card, all right, stop using debit cards, you might well use cash for now, if you want to take out money, take out money at your bank, your bank, Bank, Chase Bank, HBS, it doesn't fucking matter, ATM, okay? And if you use cash to pay for I know debit card, but it's a lot of fucking shit going on, and I'm not liking that shit, okay? So they, yeah, yeah, okay? So you want to be mindful anyway. It's going to be uh, a general read. I can post in my readings, okay? Past, and feminine energy, past, present, future. All right. Is there something else I want to say? Take what resonates, Okay. I was watching that Paid It Full movie the other day, the little boy, when they did the little boy, a person, and then how the FBI um, came in and arrested the, uh, the individual at the end of the, mo uh, the movie. Yeah, the Paid It, it's something about the Paid It Full movie. If you haven't watched it, go watch that, all right? I really feel like somebody um, ended up in that predicament like that little boy or was about to end up like that little boy, all right? It could be some drug situation involving a situation. Somebody could be linked up to the kingpin or a drug situation, the kidnapping of a, of a little boy. Then you know what happened in the little boy in the, uh, that movie Paid It Full, right? And you know what happened at the end of the fucking movie, right? All right, so that's what I'm getting um, in this situation and scenario, okay? So let's see what it is. Hopefully, guys, are having a beautiful day. If not, transmute that um, um, energy. All right. What I got was 
the hermit. Okay, somebody could be definitely getting some information on the situation. It don't have to be a story. All right, collect this or take a residence. All right, I really feel like somebody definitely searching, searching for the truth of what the answers and get to the bottom of the um, situation because whoever this was, it was locked out in the dark. Okay, so it had to be you or this individual to bring light into the situation. I right, to be able to see things from a different perspective or get some wisdom. Um, however you get wisdom from or knowledge from um, above or your downloads, um, your intuitive downloads or your intuitive side or you could be a psychic or whatever the fuck the case may be. Okay, so I'm getting here. But I really feel like these people will try to meditate on your gift and try to meditate and see if they can get give to your downloads and see if they, these people want to be the ones to turn their life in their own motherfucking darkness. How the hell are you going to turn their light in your own motherfucking darkness? That's saying that they got to reveal their own shit. You understand what I'm saying? These people are not the hermit. They want to see things the way they want to see it. They want to be how they want to be and tell the story, the narrative, how they want it to be. So how the hell are you going to turn the light in your own darkness and, and, and expose yourself? That's just exposing yourself. You see what I'm saying? That's what I'm getting. But I really feel like whoever this is could be an old guy over here, all right? And you see the old guy with the beard on it? This person been around for a many, many, many times. Many years, many lifetimes, okay? It's going to be you or the individual I'm speaking of, all right? Correct it. Let's get to it, all right? You're getting some inner guidance. You're like an old soul, okay? That baby is so many times. You have the page of pentacles here, is what I'm getting. This page, page of pentacles is trying to, uh, what I'm getting here, this person is shocked and, and surprised of the new beginning that some of you guys are having, okay? This page of pentacles represents new plans, new job, okay? Um, something that's new, okay? This is only one pentacles, but so what, okay? They're getting the ideas and creativity. I feel like what this is is playing in the dark, trying to get some wisdom from the wise guys or the or wizard or whatever to see how they can start something new on this um journey here. That's what I'm getting here collective could be you. But what I'm also getting is somebody could be focusing on a page of pinnacles on money um, new beginnings as well. Like they belong in a situation. I really feel like whoever this is is trying to gossip and grasp on how you get your money the best way you know how or the best way they think they know they know you get it. You know what I mean? The best way they know how or the best way they think they know how you get it. That's what I'm saying. The best way they think they know how you get it. Mm. Is what I'm getting. I forgot to get my other card here. Hold on for a second. Is what I'm getting here. We have somebody um who's in concern here with the 33 here. It could be a Freemason number or some old wise guy that could be looking into the situation. Okay. I already feel like they don't need to be concerned about the collective for what? You know, I mean, you ain't doing nothing wrong. You're going after yours. You feel me? Masculine or feminine. You see what I'm saying? It's about your happiness. On the top of that back, it says three of wands. So somebody was definitely planning for some new, something new or a new adventure here. All right. And they're looking at your money and seeing how you are at the, um, um, how you are able to sustain yourself. See, they wanted that in the beginning. Okay, this old person don't believe old people either because I just seen something today. Um, this old guy, he or for, for some period of reason, certain days, he wanna act crippled. Let me tell you something. Elder, I respect my elders. But some of you elders, you know damn well you ain't got nothing wrong with you. You want to play sympathy. You want to be all like in the handicap and shit. You know damn well. That man was playing. He had to, he had the cane in his damn hand trying to figure out how he going to maneuver through the, the day to day. And was acting crippled. But I guarantee you tomorrow he ain't going to need that goddamn cane. I guarantee you later on today he ain't going to need that goddamn cane. You see what I'm saying? Stop playing on that goddamn sympathy. We all um deserve um some kind of you know recognition or some kind of peace and harmony. But just because you were old don't mean that we gonna we gonna feel sorry for you. That man do that shit all the time. I'm like, look at him. He be doing that shit. I'm like he's faking. That's faking. And you know some of you, you know you got that grandmammy and them and, and the old the older old elders. They be you know, you know, on my back, oh, 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 and cause I'm old, it doesn't matter. Don't don't do that. Because what what happened if that really was? What? That man was faking. 
I meant to say that. That's funny how I seen that. And he was just like this with the cane. The only difference is he didn't have that lamp. I'm like, look at this man. He always do that shit. Every time something bad comes or he feels a certain type of way or they feel a certain type of way, they want to play on that sympathy. They want to play, oh, I'm hurt. Oh, my back. Oh, my knee. Oh, oh, this is what the car is to. Oh, my headache. Oh, I don't feel good. I'm sick. Oh, 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 oh. I could do that shit too. You don't see nobody. Let me, let me shut up. Like, stop doing it. They need to stop that shit. So what I'm getting here is the eight of swords. Somebody could be definitely trapped and stuck, stuck in a situation, blindsided. When I see this person blindsided, and I, the communication is over. I feel like this person was blindsided by this individual. They could be stuck in a situation around these people. Whoever this person is, okay, masculine and feminine. All right, that's what I'm getting. But I'm also getting that this person wasn't aware of the conniving ass individual around these snakes, okay? These snakes that want to do harm to this one individual. It could be you, masculine, it could be you, feminine, it could be somebody totally, totally, um, off the topic, okay? Uh, um, or this could be a karmic, all right? It's what I'm getting. This person is really have a fucking. What I'm skinning here is with the karmic, they don't want to stay. They want to see what they want to see. They are stuck in a situation. They feeling trapped and isolated and victimized. And this is what I'm getting with this guy. He acting like, well, I was talking about the cane. This is him in the Eight of Swords. Victimized. I want you to want to play on that sympathy type shit because you're older or younger or whatever. It doesn't even matter. These crime play on people's sympathy so fucking much. They want to cry when they want to cry, but they wasn't crying when they was doing all that other shit. They wasn't crying when they was participating in the bullshit. They wasn't crying when they was lying and sitting up there gaslighting and manipulating and shit. They wasn't crying when they was doing that spell, wasn't they? They wasn't. They, they didn't have no sympathy. They did that. Now you want to act like helpless? Then come back around tomorrow or later on today, gonna be back in the same boat and shit. And I'm gonna like, see, I told you so. You gotta pay attention to people. They be faking. They be faking. All that crying tears and shit. They be really faking. Okay, it's what I'm getting. We have to pay the ones again. This is a feminine energy. It don't have to be something new. Okay, it's what I'm getting. I really feel like this is a new journey. This is a way to. This is being fearless. This is you collective. Okay, you being very fearless. Okay, while these people are stuck and trapped in a situation, acting helpless, acting vulnerable, acting you know for you to have sympathy for these individuals so you got give them a leeway. That's how they get over on people. Okay, that's how they get over on people. And that's how they get get over on anything. And then you feel bad and you think we're the bad guys. But you don't see how they how they, how they feel. You being your authentic self. This is authenticity. Authentic self. All right. So you ain't got no time to be in this worried, loony, doomy energy. Is what I'm getting here. You all about sunshine and, 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 and lights. Okay, moving forward. Okay, on a new journey, sparking on a new journey. Whatever that inspires you. Okay, it's what I'm getting. Three of Pentacles came out. Okay, this could be a teamwork here, collaborate, collaborating to have this new beginning, to take this confidence of this person, okay? Um, and they were fearless because they were projecting. That's another thing, all right? Um, they wanted to take this person happiness. We have it on the top of this day. They wanted to grow among theirs, all right? And they also wanted to put the blame on someone, on something or an individual with the aid of soul or put on one, on one person. But see, this person is so fucking, um, so fucking um, busy, so busy with life that is not seeing these individual uh swords. All right, they really want you to be stuck away from your family and friends so they can be able to trap you mentally, physically, and spiritually so you won't be able to think. All right, it's what I'm getting here. All right, but they do um couples and groups with the three of wands, these are three people, and the three are um pinnacles as well. Okay, I really feel like they're trying to learn. This this the situation or trying to learn um from whoever this queen of I mean page or uh, pinnacle person is, all right. I also feel like whoever this is, one is studying, one is writing down, and one is actually doing the work. Um 
the 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 heavy um heavy work. You know what I'm saying? It's what I'm getting. All right, it's about uh, 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 it says uh, parentship. Is what I'm getting, but that's not what I'm getting here. I really feel like they're trying to walk on something new off of somebody else's energy. Right? And they want this person to feel trapped in the eight of swords and feel like they the fucking victim when the actual person who's being trapped in a situation is the victim. See what I'm saying? 15 minutes in and 7 seconds in. All right? So 15 minutes and 7 seconds in. That's what I'm getting. So they want you to feel bad for them. King of, King of Pentacles, you are involved, or whoever this King of Pentacles is, this is a business person, okay? This person only thinks about business. They don't think about anything else, okay? That's what I'm getting. They don't think about your emotion, your feelings, nothing. It's about money, 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 work, work, work. Whoever this, whoever this masculine is, I'm not going to say he's wealthy. I'm not going to say he's successful. He probably could be a provider or a person who's just who in a position to build something, okay? Create something. It's about creating, all right? And if you are the King um, of Pentacles, then you are a business person. Is what I'm getting. But you can't sit there and speak for somebody else's and build your own over somebody else's and claim that and claim that reward. You can't do that. All right, it's what I'm getting. I already feel like this person could be stuck up a little bit because they know it's a king of pentacles. They know it, you know, it has multiple uh, business, could be an entrepreneur, it's what I'm getting, and they know that you know it got workers to do the work for it. It's this person could all it could all this person could do is watch his money and sit on his fucking ass and, and tell who who what the hell to do is what I'm getting. It's gonna be in a five of pentacles is what I'm getting. I feel like this person could be sick or this person could be like I said, businessman, cool with third party, and the final outcome is a five of pentacles is what I'm getting here. All right. This is hardship, okay? This is from somebody else's labor, all right. It's what I'm getting. I don't know what that paper is in this person's hand. I don't know if it's a wallet, yeah, or something. But this person is sick. It's dealing with some sickness, or what this whoever this is got some kind of sickness. Okay. Um, also, what I'm getting here is heading towards poverty. All right. And also, what I'm getting is is heading towards some kind of hardship in the finances and money. All right, five is about change. So whoever this is, this person is okay leaving people out in the cold while it sits on this motherfucking throne eating his fruits of his labor while other people is putting in the hard work and labor. All right, it's what I'm getting. But I feel like this person wanted to take this new beginning away from this page of wands here. Who is vibrant? Who is fearless? Who is confidence? All right, or masculine, this could be you as a page of, uh, I mean, a knight of, uh, Pinnacles is what I'm getting. It's what I'm getting here. So this person don't even worry about his fucking finances. Justice is here, okay? Justice is definitely here, here in a situation. I really feel like whatever the fuck this is, okay, it makes sense. This person is dealing with some legal situation. It could be taking a toll on his health, his finances, and his, his business as well, okay? So this five of Pinnacles represent scandal. Debt, um, bankrupt, whatever. It's not looking good, okay, at all. But this is only temporary. You see what I'm saying? But somebody got some law involved in the situation as well. So this person is dealing with um, financial issue, health issue, and the just justice um, um, situation, the law, okay? Whatever they did, whatever they caused, it has an effect on what they did, okay? So this is some kind of clarity and some kind of truth um, in a situation. Somebody here to bring balance could be the judge or seeing the judge or whatever the case may be. Um, good and evil, weighing the, weighing the seals out, bringing balance in a situation that was unjustified. That's what I'm getting here, is what I'm getting. But I feel like this person, you know, is sitting there like, you need, you need, like, don't give a damn if you left out in the cold, even if you put in the goddamn work. So now the scale is going to be balanced out because this is not right. You don't take and weep off of somebody else's work and not pay them if you're the king of fucking um, um, pinnacles. And if this person is a king of pinnacles or businessman, then you should have no problem paying. Even stealing energetically wise as well. It's called stealing. You need to pay up, mister. 
or Mrs. Sakai resonate. You could be Queen of Pentacles, but I don't think the Queen of Pentacles is doing that. All right. And here goes the Five of Wands. There's a lot of fight between the situation um, with groups and arguments between the situation because maybe somebody wasn't getting paid, like I said, left out in the fucking cold with all the work being put in, all right, stealing people's creativity and light and shit. And this person is sitting there. So these scales have to be balanced here, okay? This is some argument. This is some chaos. There's a lot of people that's competing for the spotlight. Like, damn, I'm sorry. You ain't the man in this situation or whoever this business person is. Boss? To be a boss? Your boss ain't shit. Your boss ain't shit. Whoever you are, your boss ain't shit. Or if you sitting on the King of Pentacles, whoever boss this is, masculine and feminine, your boss ain't shit. Your boss is not paying you enough. Okay, it's what I'm getting. No, that three of pinnacles and the five fucking, fucking pinnacles, that page, yep, your boss ain't paying you enough. It ain't paying you enough. Hell no, you might need to take this nigga to court. Word, call a divine justice up in this bitch. Equal to give and take, baby. You give it as you give. Your boss is cheap as fuck. Somebody's boss is cheap as fuck. Somebody boss it is ain't shit. <laughs> I don't care. Somebody boss, yeah, here go the Queen of Wands, okay? You are very vibrant, okay? Very energetic. This is about luck as well. But what I'm getting here, you got a lot of envious energies around your Queen of Wands, okay? Man, oh, you're very independent. You could be funny and very confident. This is what they wanted to take from a feminine energy here. It's going to be a mother as well. A mother can embody a young energy or wants to be that young energy and take that spotlight because she feel like she's the Queen of fucking Wands competing with a young one. Like, grow up, please. Just grow up. Grow the fuck up. Compete with a daughter or somebody young. Or this could be a young energy, I mean, a new one who has embodied a fucking young soul. I'm talking about a young, a soul, a, a old soul. So you can embody a young body, but you could be an old soul, feminine and masculine, okay? Is what I'm getting. But this person here just sitting there, could be the wife or the girlfriend. It's not a twin, okay? It's could be a husband or wife, a business partner, where they're sitting there, like, like, like she want, like she she want, like she wants the whole goddamn thing. Like she's the queen. Like she's the queen of her her do, her domain. You see what I'm saying? Like I ain't gotta do nothing. I'm the motherfucking queen. Whoever you are, you are very royal. You're a cookie from a Egyptian bloodline. Okay, so I'm seeing the um, pyramids behind this uh, woman. Okay, that's what I'm getting. You got a lot of people fighting over and competing with a queen of wands. Okay, you could be from, uh, you could be the descendant of your ancestors of uh, the pyramid. Okay, that's what I'm getting here. All right, this is luck. This girl is luck. Okay, but she got a lot of envious in energies, wishing ill will um, behind. You could be the, um, the high priest as well. Okay, very in tune is what I'm getting. Masculine, if this is you, flip it, okay? You could be a high priest, okay? It says that you're just subconscious, but also use your third eye, okay? Always go with them, okay? You, um, listen to your gut, um, your gut feeling is what I'm getting here, collective, all right? It's what I'm getting. So, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh, uh huh, uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Yeah. I'm not going to say that. I'm not going to start saying it. Uh-uh. I'm going to do a quick video after this. I want to I wanna have fun. I want to laugh. I want to laugh. <laughs> I wanna laugh. Okay? So, yeah. Somebody could be stuck in traffic situation. They can't get out of it. Or they want this individual young energy to be trapped in a situation. Wow, they could go off on their own, building up their own business with there, but the king of pinnacles could have issued this. Whoever this man is could have issued this shit. All right, somebody investigated this whole goddamn thing. Yeah, it could be a lover here, is what I'm getting. Okay, this this lover is involved. So these people are lovers. It could be a husband, wife, boyfriend, girlfriend, business partners that are lovers. Okay, they're fucking each other. Okay, they're having sex with each other on at work, and you know, might not even fucking know it. These people, this queen and this king. They are complete opposite are fucking lovers. They're having sex with each other. Or if this is not, this is two men or two women or this weird ass fucking 
dynamic going on. Like, it don't give a fuck if he had a sex with another man or she don't give a fuck if she had a sex with another woman. It's some nasty shit going on. It's what I'm getting. And it could be a match, but I don't, I, whatever. But it was supposed to be peaceful here, okay? Somebody came up pinnacle, pinnacle. It could be somebody loving that's involved in the situation. You gotta love her, all right? That's what I'm getting. I know the lover, okay? It says lovers, so multiples with an S, okay? So it's multiple lovers here. Yeah, they are definitely kissing on a job or on a site, you know, hugging up, you know what I mean? Getting butt naked, you already know. Like I said, fuck it. They are definitely fuck it, okay? That's probably where that sickness coming from with the five of pentacles is what I'm getting. Yeah, adjudications in reverse. Okay, it came out on the floor. So the love is in reverse adjudication. This is unequal, unbalanced, okay? No, no, no fairness. This is not seeing the justice system right now, or they're not in court right now dealing with the justice system. What they're dealing with is something that's behind closed doors that they, these individuals feel like they can cause judgment or they can make decision on a person's life or situation or, or circumstances. No, the fuck you're not because they're not in a position to do that. All right, it's what I'm getting. These people feel like they're not gonna be brought to justice. No, oh, my man and my, 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 and it came in reverse. Adjudication came in reverse. It's the masculine and the feminine. They feel like they can dodge the the justice system, and that justice system came right there. They don't play that shit. The source is up. You know what I mean? You know, cut through that butter smoothly. Yeah, occupation. What they do for work. All right? It's what they do for work. What do these people really do for work? Okay? What do they do? What is your job? What is their job title? What's their occupation? Okay? What do they do for free time? Okay? What are their um, gifts? Okay? It's what I'm getting here. So, you got to find out what these individuals do um, um, at, at work and job. It could be hearing things. It could be carpenter. It could be contractor. It could be, you know, peer person. What do they do? What do they do for work? How they get their money? You know, who's paying them? Who's the boss? Okay? Where, 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 where's the he said, or you know what I'm saying? Um, it, do you file IR, um, tax? Do you, you know, um, file your IRS or whatever the fucking case may be? You know what I'm saying? Shit like that. What's their occupation? Who they got back up? Those, does the date matches? Does the time matches? Does the year matches? They want to keep someone um, in distance, distance horizon. They want to keep a situation apart as long as possible. Okay, so from the truth of being revealed, or you for, or this person for um, having some kind of clarity. But that country, the anchor, um, is off this boat, so it's floating all over the fucking place. It's not stable. It's not still. The more you have these people floating all over the place, it is is harder for you to be tracking or whatever. That's what they want. Okay, you drop the merchandise over here, there, there. You flying over there, here, there, there, there. You know, it's like you're running from something, and you're not still. So whoever this is, they can't keep you stuck. They can't keep you still. They can't sit that boat on a dock. They can't. You 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 know, whoever this is, you're free to fly. All right. They don't have no position or no power to keep you or hit out or hold you um captive. Okay. They cannot put that anchor on your boat. I said auntie, the anchor on your boat. All right, it's what I'm getting. They can't. It's business wise, mentally, physically, um, financially as well, is what I'm getting. Okay. It's what I'm getting. This could be some kind of Merchandise they order online or online is what I'm getting what I'm talking about or early um in the beginning of the reading. This could be some merchandise that you you know coming from overseas and shit like that, ordering things overseas. Um don't know where the, the shit coming from, don't know where, you know, who who's putting in the order or who's who's initiating the, the 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 transaction and shit is what I'm getting here. All right, it's dealing with jobs and corporation and business. And you got all these merchandise coming from here, here, from this app, from this custo a customer, from this location. It's all over the fucking place, is what I'm getting. Ooh, hey. What I'm getting, all right. So you need to be mindful of your debit card, your bank card, your checking account, um, all kind of things, even your um, um, prepaid card as well. All right, it's what I'm getting. They try to steal the information from stores, so they get cool with the person that's in the stores. So now I know I'm paying shit with cash and cash only. All right, 
And for those who are who are familiar with don't using cash and don't using you know um, debit cards and all this um, LLC business and you know you don't have to use cash and open up with LLC and whatever. Okay, so a lot of people us is not there yet. You know what I'm saying? Whatever. All right, this could be in despair once it, because I feel like whatever this is been blocked. Okay, there's no job hiring and getting no money and nobody's hiring and people are being laid off and shit like that and they don't want these type of people because they know these type of people got to get down okay nobody want to hire these people nobody want to work with these people they know how these fucking people get down you see the people in a, in a window they know how these people get down they're grinding me and nobody want to hire these people nobody want to rent them nothing nobody want to do business with them nobody and now that i come to the conclusion that Niggas is doing this shit to all over the people. Did you hear about the food stamp thing? The people was over in California was stealing people's food stamp information. And it's going on for three months. People been stealing people. How the hell, how the hell the government allow individuals for another state, another country, another state, that's not New York, because it's happening to everybody in Brooklyn. And you know Brooklyn people, this is another minority of black, um, melanated people. So, and why you target them? If you hear about that shit, for those who do or have it or whatever, you better check your ABT because a lot of them people is stealing people's cash and food stamps. And it happened in Brooklyn. Go check it out. Go online and go check it out because that happened. And if you know people that live in Brooklyn, you'll know what exactly what I'm talking about. You'll know what I'm saying is crap. So there is some shit that's going on with these cars that these people are tapping into and get information. But then as way well as a full stamp card, you should be mindful and careful as well. If you're going to stores, bodegas, dailies, or whatever, or any ATM, I advise you just go to the cash, cash check cash in place or the regular bank. And full stamp, um, what, they gonna go to the supermarket and steal your shit? That don't make no sense. That don't fucking make any sense. This is crazy. It happened to people in Brooklyn, y'all. And I, I learned it on um Instagram. I was looking at um one of the new feed and it popped up. And I'm like, what the fuck? Why why I'm only in Brooklyn? I don't know. It could be all over. But yeah, um share this video because it could be happening to anybody all over and you might need you need to because she said she they said they a lot of them said they went back and checked and it was zero so what the fuck is going on like how do you fucking with people's debit card and not only that that's not even enough you going in you going into the government shit that is government's money that i mean not government money but i'm just saying you know what i'm saying when you mess with the government, that is federal shit. You know what I mean? I mean, like, you don't... That's federal. That's federal. It's federal time, federal time. You see what I'm saying? Like, that is government shit. Like, what are you doing? That I know that don't belong to the, the government. The money don't belong to the government, but what I'm saying is, you know, it... it and they control it. How about that? It's some weird shit going on. It's some weird shit. So people in the Brooklyn, you got loved ones or whatever, and they get that, notify them and, 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 and tell them what's up, okay? Because, or share this video with them so they can, you know, make sure that they shit is good, right? And for those like me, I experienced with the, 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 um, the debit or my Visa, uh, or whatever, you got MasterCard or was it Visa, Master, the other shit, whatever. Um, whatever, you need to check up. You need to check your shit on a regular and have that shit sent, set up where it goes to your email or your messages. Set up your thing where you can have anything transaction go right through your phone, your email. Anything that tra that's making a transaction or it doesn't even fucking matter. Um, it goes right to your messages, okay? So make sure that that that, that you set that shit up ASAP. When you finish looking at this, you notify other people. Set up your kids' shit too, okay? To yours and, and or to theirs. You gotta, you gotta know that because you got a lot of people out here that is corrupt and crooked. And I believe it came from that location that I used my, only use it from that one location, that brand new car. So I know exactly where it came from. Because that day when I was telling you about the debit card, that's exactly, that probably the that same day that I went over there to that shit. And that only Indian guy was in working, working in there. And there was two other fucking uh, Hispanic 
niggas standing right behind me when I was taking money out from the thing. Luckily, I put transfer that to my other motherfucking uh, prepaid card. So I ain't got to worry about that shit, okay? Family room, keeping secrets here, okay? They could be keeping some secrets. There's some secrets going on here, all right? They could be talking in cold. Only you or you, if you're part of their family, then you will. If you're a part of their family, they, they can take, talk secrets, codes out they and their family. But since me and you are not a part of it, because I don't want to be a part of that stupid shit, they don't, they talk in language that their own, only their people can understand. And also, what I'm getting with this family room, the occupation could be something with sewing, cutting, or mastering in um, chic rocks or cement or building some um, thing. Another thing, when I said it in the other video, oh, they have to, yeah, they close the door downstairs. In the basement, yeah. Mm -hmm. And also, they made another door, another unit upstairs, cause that door was never that that unit was never next to no nine. So they now they building another units to cut off whatever it is. They're building another units now, cause what that wasn't there. That was the only fucking um, thing there. So they're actually building other units, other units. I know this apartment. The guy that came in here said this problem was never like this. It had a back door, and this problem was long. So they cut this in half and made it to end, whatever the fuck they made this apartment into. I said, this apartment had a back door? I said, yeah, you used to have a back door. So down there, like I said, the re renovation is changing things up and adding and taking away and expanding and shortening it, okay? It's what I'm getting. And that's why things don't seem familiar. But I'm like, he said, you have a back door? I'm like, hmm. I ain't no back door. You gotta go check. Like, yeah, this used to be a back door. That's how I know this apartment was a long fucking, a long one. So they cut this, they, however they designed it, they cut it. Um, another thing I wanted to mention um, here is there could be some individual that's buried in walls. When I first moved here and did here, because I prayed, it was a little girl stuck in the wall. I heard a little girl verse voice, but the reason why I'm saying it now because it's, it's, it's over. It's, she probably gone and dead and suffocated and whatever. They like to bury people in walls. And I thought it was some ghost shit. I thought it was some, 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 uh, because whoever watching this, and you know anything about this place, you already, like, listen, go look at my beginning of my goddamn videos and look all them throughout. You want to get an understanding, okay? Um, It was a girl buried in the wall and I thought it was coming from no, it, it came from the, they buried the bitch in the wall, I mean, sorry, they buried the girl in the wall, so if you knock this wall down, you might find skeletons in the goddamn wall, okay, yeah, and that's, that's another thing, um, I got, I, I meant to speak on that, the, uh, I don't know who did that, whoever designed this shit, whoever fucking built this shit, whoever painted this shit, whoever, because the wall's speaking, because this wall don't look like, you know what I'm saying, these walls do not look like at all, okay, anyway, I think it was a little girl, okay, it's a girl, I, I don't know if she's black, I don't think she's black, I think she's probably Puerto Rican or Hispanic or white, but yeah, the girl, later on, I figured out the the, the, the noise that I was hearing, because they must have told her something, I, it took me a minute, the girl is buried in the walls, and if you knock the walls down, you'll find a lot of shit in these walls, The girl was buried in a wall, chained to something. They buried the bitch alive. I mean, sorry, they buried the girl alive. So who knows what, who knows, every time when I left, when I first moved here, who knows if they must have said something, something to the wall. Who knows if they must have said something to her they, or, or scare her or whatever. Who knows? You know what I'm saying? Because after that, I didn't hear it no more. So like now I'm, I'm getting analyzed. I'm like, they must have came in when I wasn't aware of it. Because when you move here, you're not aware of it. And until later. So obviously the girl is not alive. Okay? And if you break the walls down, you'll probably find the girl's skeleton. Family secrets. Occupation. What this look like? Third party, three of pentacles. What he look like he got? He look like got a hammer, right? I'm going to leave it off like that, y'all. I'm going to come back with another one. I hope, hopefully, guys, are having a beautiful day. All right? Um, Peace out, y'all.